what's up gamers welcome back to what i don't even know what to tell you what this is this is minecraft but it's terraria or i guess it's terraria but it's minecraft i, I don't know you choose down in the comments down below what this is but this is terraria craft this is made by dragon forge and we've got the soundtrack this is not edited music i did not edit this music in but this is Minecraft Terraria. I have no idea what to expect. I just heard that they had updated these mods recently. So we're going to create a new world. We're going to call this Terraria Craft Minecraft. And then just see what happens. If you guys do enjoy, you know what to do. Make sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you're new. It lets me know that you want to see more. Oh, whoa. Look at that. The inventory system is Terraria. We've got the health system on the top right. Mana. Whoa, the inventory even works that way too. Are you kidding me? Hey, how's it going? Uh, it's got the terraria sounds this is dope this is awesome okay quick disclaimer i love terraria i actually had just recently uh played it on my own off camera i got to the hard mode and that's where i stopped but i love this game and uh yeah there's gonna be no music by the way no edited music we're just gonna have the background sounds this is awesome i love this so can i we got mushrooms oh i guess we need a, a copper axe it's even got the sound effect can i eat this this is so crazy it's so good it is so good this is like i said i have not seen any gameplay i've seen like a screenshot oh my god i saw like a screenshot i'm like there's no way this is this good and it is you even have money this is so awesome okay well i don't where do we start so now the question is does the crafting system work like that too so slimes are obviously the primary like basic enemy we see in the game why don't we just start it off simple let's go get some trees you know get some mushrooms some cactuses but we don't really want cactuses okay you even have dirt blocks that they work just like that. that's so cool Oh, this is so cool all right i'm having fun already let's get the basic materials let's see if this works out how i think it will and let's get some wood so if i'm not mistaken if we break it from the bottom yes it does i this is so cool this is amazing i don't know how they did this but i'm immediately having an amazing time because i love terraria so this is amazing let's keep moving around let's see if we can find a forest i feel like we need more wood unfortunately it, unfortunately it looks like my seed has put me in a pretty rough spot because there is not a whole lot to look at Ooh! oh my gosh that must be a crimson area so those are basically infected areas that's why the tree is red over there just a quick disclaimer as well i am playing on minecraft 112.2 so it's a kind of an older version of Minecraft, but not too old. Uh, we got cactuses. You know what? Sure, I'll get some cactuses. We got the ice area over there. Desert, crimson, air, infected area. I feel like let's go to the snow area. Let's go. What's the worst that could happen? I don't know if you noticed as well. The mod creators had uh, customized this mod so that when you switch areas like biomes, the music actually changes according to the biome like it does in terraria which i think is so cool that frozen that ice soundtrack that is so this is so cool man i love this so much like i said terraria has got a great soundtrack i'm gonna say that right now all right well we are now in the ice area let's get some more wood from here as well so the wood is actually different we got boreal wood okay the great thing about terraria is there's no hunger so i don't have to worry about getting food from animals i'm just chilling just get some mushrooms and you're good all right what is this this looks like it is aha this is tin so tin is one of the starting metals we can get to build some materials so that's nice to find right away so if i break a block it actually stays broken for a bit and then it retracts that's pretty interesting there's so many different things we've even got that nighttime tune that's a banger all right well we've got a lot of blocks here why don't we go ahead i'm gonna throw this away here uh why don't we go ahead and start building our home so i know that we don't have walls necessarily in minecraft and i need some more trees but we can go ahead and actually plant a ton of trees here with acorns so i'm gonna do that now i wonder if they even have it coded so that i seriously doubt it but it would be really cool if they had the guide that comes to your house once you build it, it would be very cool but like i said this is a obviously a very early developed terraria mod so there's just no way they'd have it but it would be dope all right just like that we are simple living look at that now that's what i call home let's go ahead and light her up so that we don't have the mobs spawning around here that is beautiful all right guys so now that we built a house and stuff and we got to play terraria a bit unfortunately that's as far as it goes uh this is a completely you know 
like a, it's, a, it's a mod being developed by only a few people it's it's you know it's a mod it, it's not the actual game so what we're gonna do to enjoy the experience a little bit more and show off what you can do as of right now we're gonna hop into creative mode and just show off all the different things you can do all the different items and the different dimensions as well uh because as much as i love this there's only so much you can do but as you can see we've got terraria craft items and we've got like items like the whoopee cushion we've got arrows here which we will take a look in a second flower of fire we've got mana crystals wand of sparking we've got a bunch of other stuff like the slime staff we've got potions over there and then there's a bunch of fragments eventually like these things will be used to uh go ahead and craft some items obviously in the game like coins we've got stars lenses and obviously look at how many ingots we've got i i just realized that my face cam is good job alex you did that whole explanation while your face cam was blocking everything all right so my face cam is now on this side or this side whatever it doesn't matter but as you can see we've got a ton of different ores we got dyes we got mushrooms uh items here there we're everywhere and we go to tools we've got up to molten pickaxes we got paladillum pickaxes we've got tungsten axes as you can see it only goes up to tungsten even though there's you know insanely powerful axes we go up to enchanted sword that's the highest tier tungs and bow and we go to accessories we got band of regeneration hermes boots which is a personal favorite cloud in a bottle another favorite city and skull we've got water walking boots obsidian water walking boots ice skates angel wings one of the best items and a lot more like fairy wing then we go to the items over here we got furnaces we got we got workbenches we've got the anvils we've got a ton of stuff here like chests we've got crates we've got items we've got altars which is insanely cool and uh that's about it that's that's all we've got obviously there's so many more items that are in terraria but let's let's mess around so yep that's an item uh anyways let's keep on going but we got the enchanted sword which if you didn't know if you, you can actually shoot out like lightning bolts which is amazing not lightning bolts exactly but you know it's close wah, wah, wah. pretty dope and we've got the paladin pickaxe which obviously is insanely fast We've got the tungsten axe we've got the bow which i think we have to get our arrows and equip them yes so the bows and obviously terraria are like as fast as you can go so that's super satisfying then i'm gonna go ahead and equip my hermes boots and the thing you if you didn't know about hermes boots is the more you run on a stable area the faster you go which is amazing so i can do this if we go over to our mana crystals i'm gonna quickly use some of those get a bunch of mana there we go now i've got like the flower of fire which i can toss out fire here you go i'm like mario then we've got the wand of sparking which is super dope because that's basically the same thing but a little bit weaker we've got the slime staff which is my personal favorite because we get a slime friend hello slime friend attack 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 no okay he just sort of sits there got cloud in a bottle which obviously lets you double jump which is awesome angel wings which lets you fly not uh, like permanently but you like can go up a bit ow and we got fairy wings which lets you do basically the same thing but you can also uh yeah no that's about it that's about it now personal favorites we got ice mirrors which lets you go back to the spawn same thing with the magic mirror and then obviously we've got like the workbench the furnace the gold chest we've got the anvil and the demon altar so these are all necessities you need in normal terraria except for the demon altar which obviously uh is a thing that is bad but i mean you can craft stuff in it which is nice but one thing we can do if we go to sash summon terraria there's a couple things we can summon that aren't actually shown in like the game so like npc terraria npc hello as you can see like i said this game is very early on you can talk to him but he's a work in progress but why don't we go ahead and we're gonna go ahead into spectator mode now i'm gonna show you guys what happens when you go into the cave systems now every block has been replaced which is super cool and everything but there, they even have the heart crystals you've got iron you've got like copper in here uh lead gold there's a ton and ton a ton of stuff and that's not it obviously there's no like uh caves with like zombies and chests in here but if you go down you notice this is ash block and if you keep going down we end up in the hell dimensions this is a completely separate dimension from normal nether which the nether and the end is completely the same but you've got the hell dimension these are hell hellstone ores which is incredibly cool like i said once this mod if it ever gets completed it'll be incredible to see how minecraft is when it's terraria because you know we've got like the the boss battles like the wall of flesh like that would be insane 
You've got all the, uh, the loot you can get. There's so many different items and loot and everything in Terraria. Seeing it in Minecraft would be pretty dang cool. Well, that's about all I can show you guys because that's about it. But I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, you know what to do. Make sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you're new. If you did enjoy, you know what to do. Let me know in the comments as well. One thing I didn't check as well is if maybe there is like a, a cloud area. Because if you didn't know in Terraria, there are like cloud, uh, like the sky cities, I think is what they were called. I Although, I, I mean, I doubt they would have them. But hello, slime friend. He can fly. He's cool like that. Aha, so we did get the achievement into orbit, which is pretty cool. But I think that's about it. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, <laughs> you know what to do. Make sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you're new. Let me know. Did you enjoy Terraria in Minecraft or Minecraft, but it's Terraria? I don't really know. But I love the music of the Terraria franchise. I love all of this. This is super dope. But uh, hopefully they finish it. I will definitely be playing it. I hope you guys will too. See you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day and goodbye. Yay.